Chargers TV here at the Durham Entertainment Centre where the Launceston Tornadoes have got the win against the Hobart Chargers, 86 to 82. And with me now is the captain of the Launceston Tornadoes, Lauren Mansfield. Lods, great game, great heart and determination by your girls to get that gutsy win. Yeah, um, you know, it was a tough game. We knew it was going to be tough. Um, Hobart's a great team, but, um, you know, we managed to stick with them and then pull, pull out the win at the end. Uh, throughout that game, Hobart were able to push the lead a little bit, but then you guys had answers, but the biggest answer of all was late in that fourth quarter. Yeah, I think um, we had some players really step up. I think Ellie played really well towards the end, and, um, you know, Tay made plays, and Loz was awesome tonight. So um, I'm really proud of the girls and really happy to get the win. Just one player I want to mention, um, Rebecca Abel. Um, yeah. Rebecca coming from the West Coast, as, as am I. I'm a former West Coast person myself too. But her development, and she played some solid defence tonight. Have you kind of mentored her throughout the season and then gave her tips here and there? Yeah, I mean, I think I try to. Um, I also play with her in Penguin as well. So um, I think me and, me and Beck have a good relationship and, um, you know, she just keeps getting better every year I come back. So um, I'm really proud of her development and I think um, she's going she's gonna to go places. Obviously, I just want to quickly, briefly touch on the, on the Opus experience you had uh, just a couple of weeks ago. How was that for you and obviously a different level of international competition? Yeah, it was, uh, I must, oh, I think, um, <laughs> it was, yeah, a really cool experience. Um, obviously disappointed with um, the loss towards the end, but, um, you know, it was an awesome experience and um, I really enjoyed it and, um, yeah, I'm really happy to be back though and um, to play in the Siebel finals. Is there anything you took from the experience to bring back into, into the tournament here? Yeah, I think there's lots of things. I, I learnt a lot um, offensively and defensively and um, I think it was very motivating as well just playing at that next level and I've come home and I feel like I've got lots to work on to get better and um, to be able to you know keep improving. So yeah, it was an awesome, awesome experience and I learned a lot. I spoke to Richard just before we spoke to you about um, Dan Ong and Bendigo play tomorrow night. Obviously you'll play the loser of that game next week. Yeah. Um, obviously we can't determine a result but will you, will you be preparing for both teams next week? Um, yeah, I think so, definitely. Um, I'm just excited to keep playing with these girls. You know, I really, really enjoy these girls. So, um, yeah, I think we'll be focused on whoever um, we've got next and, you know, um, just trying to get the next win. And how determined are you guys to go as deep as you can? That belief and determination by you girls tonight was absolutely awesome. Yeah, it was amazing. I think, you know, that's always been the goal and I, I think we have the talent to achieve it. It's just a matter of, um, you know, being disciplined and, and executing down the stretch and I think we are really showed what we're capable of tonight. Um, you know, we have, have a lot of depth and we have a lot of players that can come on and um, make an impact. So, I mean, it's, it's exciting and um, I'm excited for what's ahead. Well, great job, Lauren, tonight and uh, best of luck next week on the road. Thank you. Thank you.